Storm Team meteorologist Lindsay Rachel with Central New York's most accurate forecast. Good Sunday morning. This is our view from our Poppy Tower camera. We've seen brighter, we've seen darker and gloomier. Uh, we do have the clouds with us for today. We have some rain showers as well. But you know, yesterday we had some sunshine, we had the warmth, we had some rain too. So take a look at this picture that was submitted to our News Channel 9 Facebook page. Rosa said, Rainbow Delight, a double rainbow. Beautiful. We've got a lot of great photos. Share more to our News Channel 9 Facebook page so we can share them this morning. Yesterday it was warm. It was a little bit muggy too. Did you notice that? We had temperatures that rise into the low 70s here in Syracuse, and we had about seven tenths of an inch of rain as well. Temperatures since then have been falling steadily. Uh, last evening we were in the 50s. Overnight, we fell into the 40s. We're right now 43 degrees in Syracuse. We're 41 in Sodus in Cortland. Low 40s, pretty much for everybody to start the day. Our temperatures today, they stay in the low 40s for this morning. We're eventually going to be falling into the 30s later on this afternoon. We also have some rain, like right now. We have some light rain showers pushing through Syracuse, uh, Ledyard into Cortland, Pitcher, and for Madison and Utica. We also have a bit of a gusty wind with us this morning. It's Sustained out of the southwest at 14 miles per hour here in Syracuse, but they could gust up to 25, 30 miles per hour later on this afternoon out of the west. So that's going to make it feel colder, more like the 30s for today. Here's a look at your time cast. We'll start things off 7 o'clock this morning. We have those light rain showers, some dry time, but we stick with the clouds all day. Once we get to lunchtime in this afternoon, then we do have some lighter rain pushing through. And you notice the higher elevations north, the higher elevations south. We have some wet snow mixing in there as well. Accumulations will be little to none, though. Once we get to this evening beyond sunset time, we are quieting down. High pressures building in. Temperatures are dropping more into the 30s. Some areas to the north. North could be dropping into the upper 20s, so it is going to be a bit chilly. Tomorrow, we start off with some clouds. Temperatures are close to the freezing mark, and then tomorrow afternoon, mainly quiet, mainly dry, and I think we do get some sunshine in here for our Monday. It is still a little bit breezy. Temperatures are in the 40s, upper 40s, but it'll probably feel closer to the low 40s for tomorrow. Tuesday, we have more sunshine. We're in the mid 40s, still a little bit above where we should be for this time of year, so not too bad. Wednesday, Day. We're starting the day off pretty quiet and dry. We do have some rain coming in for the afternoon and the evening. Temperatures are in the upper 40s. We're close to 50 on Thursday with some rain showers still lingering. Friday is mainly quiet at this point, maybe a spotty shower here or there. Uh, we're still close to 50 on Friday, Thursday, or Saturday, next weekend. Some rain, some snow showers possible. And you know, with spring, I mean, it snows here in central New York sometimes through April, in, even into May. So, we're not quite done with it just yet, uh, but nothing too terrible in the seven-day forecast here.